Hi there, welcome to my tutorial video on how to turn this really new popular game called the Watermelon Game into English and how to play it on your PC. It's actually really easy to do um, and we're going to be using Yuzu. I'm sure you can use Ryujinx. Uh, you can also do this if you have a homebrewed switch because it is a mod obviously to be able to turn it into English. Um, so let's get started. Right click on the game after you've added your ROM into Yuzu. Right click it. Do dump a ROM FS and then click OK and then do full. It's going to take a few seconds and once you press OK, it is going to open up the folder. Uh, we're also going to go into our downloads folder real quickly. And we are going to here, let me just delete this. We're going to create a new folder here. Um, we're going to call it X Delta. Just bear with me, OK? We might be going a few steps ahead just to save some time. So we're doing a resource assets, shared assets, one dot assets and shared assets, three dot assets. You're going to copy those and you're going to put them over here. And then we are going to open up a link in the description. Um, this was posted by Blashy, by the way. Um, so if you uh, click the first link in the description, you're going to come here to, the, to this GitHub page. Um, what you're going to need to do is click on releases over here, this first release button, and then just click on watermelon game patches.zip. When you do that, it is gonna download. And then another thing you're gonna need is gonna be another link in the description, which is gonna take you here to get X Delta UI. Just click download files now. It's gonna ask you to verify that you're human by just doing a quick, simple captcha. And then once you do that, um, we're gonna go over back to our uh, downloads folder. And I guess I don't need that open anymore. Um, we're going to right click this, or we're going to just open this and a new window. And then we're just going to drag those bad boys right into there. Now our patches are also downloaded. going to get those. Now these ones obviously are going to be, um, in a folder. We're just going to do new folder real quickly. We're going to delete this afterwards anyways, move this over into that folder. And then we're going to open X Delta. Whoops, not that one. The UI, because I'm a, I'm a baby and I like UI. If you do another folder as well, this is just going to be called Patched, just for simplicity. We're going to click Opened over here next to Patched. And then we're going to just do that. Go over here. We're going to grab our first patch, which is resource.assets.xdelta. We're going to open up our source file, which is the same file, and then the output it's going to be the same thing. I'm going to click on it just so we get the name real quickly. And then we're going to go into patched and click save. And then do patch. And you're going to get this message real quickly. Just going to do that two more times. So go into new folder, do the shared assets one, go back out of it into here, and then click on it again, go into patched, save, patch. And one last time. Get the shared assets three. And then save that one. Now you have all the files are patched. And now all that you have to do is just copy those. Go back to Yuzu, right click, go to open mod data location, uh, make a new folder, call it whatever you want. It doesn't matter. This is just like the name of the mod essentially. Um, and then inside that folder, make a folder called ROM FS. And then in that one, make one called data and then just paste those three files. So I'm just going to do that just to show it works. And then we're going to open the game again. And you're going to see that this time when you open it, it's going to be in English. It was a really, really quick, easy thing. Thank you uh, to the dude who made this mod. And uh, hopefully this video helped you. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.